Hi guys, this is Paula Ram helping you create the beautiful life you were made for. And today I want to talk to you about dreams, dreams and wishes. Do you have some big dreams or wishes or ways you would like to see your life, but you kind of feel stuck and like, that's never going to happen. It's just pie in the sky. Yeah, you know, that's never going to happen type attitude. And um, I'm going to tell you a story. I'm going to tell you a story that maybe could change your thinking on this. Um, we had um, a family come to um, our community with an entrepreneurship conference. Um, it was more like a family entrepreneurship conference, how you can teach your kids to become entrepreneurial, uh, you know. And it was really good, really good training and inspiration for family home businesses. And they worked together with their kids who were mostly teenagers. Um, and afterwards, they, we all came over to our house after the conference for dinner. And we were just talking and stuff. And I was talking with one of the teen daughters. And there on my coffee table were several coastal living magazines. And she's like, oh, you know, do you like the beach? Do you like, you know, the coast? I'm like, oh yeah, I would love to live there one day. And she was just like, well, what are you doing to get there? And I'm like, what do you mean? What am I doing to get there? <laughs> Nothing. I'm just wishing and hoping and looking through Coastal Living Magazine, right? I'm like, it like never occurred to me, like there was actual steps I could do or actual ways I could be intentional, uh, intentional about meeting that goal, that dream. It just, because it just seemed so unattainable. I wasn't even thinking that way or going that way. It just, you know, you just survive through daily life, right? You get up, you feed the kids, you do school, you go to bed, you know, it's just like, it's just your daily routine. And before you know it, your whole life can go by and maybe the big goals or dreams you wanted to have for your life never happen. Um, so the key, I mean, that was life changing for me. This just teen girl asking me that question. Well, what are you doing? What are you doing to uh, realize that dream was just was life changing for me. And it got me thinking that way and realizing the power of intention. We have to learn to be intentional about our lives. And we can't just drift through, go with the flow, and just whatever happens, deal with it, or live like reactionary, or putting out fires, or just getting through the day. Um, you really don't want to live that way. You really need to be intentional. And that starts with, of course, um, looking at your priorities. What is important to you? What are your values? What is it that's really important that you want to accomplish? What do you want to see your family look like? What type of person do you want to become? You know, picture what would your ideal day look like? What would your ideal life look like? What would your ideal family life look like? Your ideal marriage, what would that look like? And don't just hope or wish those things will happen. Once you realize, okay, get clear on what those are, what your values are and what's important to you, then you must be intentional about the steps you're going to take to get there. That is key. There's no wishing about it. There's no dreaming. There's no hoping. There's none of that because you'll just be stuck the same place you are now. 10 years ago, you'll still be there. And is that really where you want to be 10 years from now? Um, and those values and priorities and goals are going to look different for everyone. It may not be your dream to live near the coast. Um, it could be totally, you may want to be a missionary in Africa or it could be anything. Only you know what your vision is. And of course, we all want to have closer, stronger families and marriages. Um, so just sit down with your husband and work that out. What are what is important to you and then be intentional realize you've got to be intentional about getting there or you'll just still be sitting where you are now in 10 or 20 years so i hope that gives you something to think about guys and helps you on your path toward 
creating a beautiful life. All right, bye.